for letting the intro rock. Laika, our soul player, definitely looks human. So who could potentially take it? I don't know. Nice check right over there. That is not safe to approach over there. So I, I think something to note is Laika has played ITH, who's kind of our um, consistently high placing Viking. Placing Viking, yeah. Quite a bit. So I think Laika is probably very familiar with this matchup. Um, I don't know how familiar Ika is. Oh my god. Yeah, those setups are dirty, man. Uh, Laika was getting me a lot with that too. Basically, you, you whip with a button on wake up. You stand up and you think they whiff, but they actually didn't. And they they get, didn't, they yeah. Get tick her off of it. Yeah, uh, frame kill setups are, are a very good uh, traditional part of like and an, an, um, fighting games. And it's one thing that I said with Rory, um, as Viking gets the offense right over there. It's one of those things that like you can transfer to any concept in any fighting game. But you can also use the essence of Guilty Gear when it comes to reversal throws, or when it comes to like a bar a checks in certain situations to kind of reinforce that basic offense that like you like to see. Oh, gets that counter hit off of the 5 HS. Red RC. Oh, so now you're not going to burst. Yeah. Okay, that's... Yes, sir. Follow stroke got that big damage. Oh, my God. He still had that long normal that went all the way up. I forgot they that button was already there. there. And uh, Laika showing, you know, hey, uh, I've been doing this. I feel pretty good. Yep. I'm just not going to let the Viking player play. <laughs> you know, if there's like Habari or like if there's anything, you know, over there that's making Ooh, a little it. profile then, yeah. Nice I dig that. I dig how he represented that option. He just said Eno is the only one that has a stroke around here. I dig that. I dig it. Oh, meet some inner air conversion. But RC, only one overhead. All this blocking, all this blocking. Look at the wrist gauge. Let me get smoked. Oh my gosh. Oh, my God. oh okay. that was a reversal throw. Tether. I definitely understand that. Nice. It took the burst. But it was like half a second that like Ika waited. Ika waited and like went into there and got hit by the burst right over there. He's sitting on a bar, so he Ooh, can't. Nice. Oh, okay. Right, no. <laughs> can't confirm. Yep. Yeah, into the nice. kill. Nice. Okay. Good comeback by Ika here. Very good stuff. Okay, taking the round and then second game setting. Probably take for another one. Ooh, whip that completely. That's oh gonna be God, like 45% of your life for no reason. Oh boy. Pressure. Mm -hmm. oh God. Look at Pika's wrist gauge too. It was flashing red. Oh, nice counter hit. Pika, man, Ooh, trying to get out of here. Red RC. Yo, nice. he could not buy his way out of this corner though. Micah for everything, just until like half a second ago was just containing them. Goes into the confirm into the super. Knocked down. This is going to put him away. Full screen. Not going to get much off of that. Oh, what nice a throw. throw. Do it again. Do it again. I'm so glad oh. he didn't. Oh, TRC. Oh, okay. Taking That's no kill. That's no kill. Nice. Hey, I, I really liked how Ika, though, was very composed when he was getting bullied oh, in the of course, corner. Yeah. Like, he almost made that That was that a long time. You saw the risk, like you pointed out, the risk gauge was going hella far, and then he was just composed, blocking there, sitting there, yeah. didn't overexert his escape trying to get out there, and didn't take unnecessary damage. Yep. I saw that, too. That was very good stuff. There, there. I went oh over there. My yep. God. That's experience, but that's also technology that you can use to avoid that form of offense because there is a gap there. Good yeah. stuff. Ooh, oh, six feet out of there. Beautiful. Everybody's been having trouble with that. Ooh. Literally box jump out of there, get hit by that move that hits everywhere. <laughs> There's a burst on the table, but waiting for it. yeah, yeah. yeah. Dump, dump. yeah. Laika looking good. I I'll tell you what, man. Laika's one of those. Uh, he's one of those lab monsters, man. Yeah. Like, and you can tell, right? Yeah. You can tell I can how tell. He's going on the I definitely look. Like that. Yeah. Like, this man. Uh, and it's kind of funny because you kind of give soul players like crap for being like a gorilla be a or gorilla, like very yeah. But like is different, man. the different. scariest thing and like historically in Guilty Gear's history, when you see like the more composed and more researched soul players, I know Romola is definitely one of the more common ones. Um, there's also a couple of like Japanese soul players, but like once you see them, they're monsters. Yeah, because it's like you know if you the character has the Onga ability. Yeah, right? yeah. So you course. don't need to always play you like You don't, that. yeah. Like, you really don't. But, you know, it's there if you need to. But, uh, 
Once you maximize the risk reward, like, I think it'll benefit a lot, especially with the changes that happen to the character. Once toned down a bit, but definitely still capable of being solid. Yeah, yeah still, still. Yeah. I mean, he's still a character where if he, if he catches you with a counter hit, like, it's, it's pretty massive. Oh, yeah, you're getting smoked. And the yeah, pressure yeah. right yeah. here is... Um, you still got to block. Yeah, you still got to block when it comes to soul, okay? Like, let's not act like you don't. And that's going to be the game. Oh, that's going to be the... Yeah. 3 0. Um, Good stuff to Ika, the yeah. fourth place, I believe. Yeah. Um, great showing, and again, like he's just been placing higher and higher. So, even if, even in that case where he went 0 and 3, I definitely did think there were some good uh, defensive options that he represented very comfortably. As you saw, he did the extended block string when he was in the corner, it didn't get exposed as much, had the risk rage go up, did not make a mistake, did not get counter hit, and he got a massive form of damage. So his prowess is there. It's just you know the ironing rubbing against, you know, the crafting blade, and he's just sharpening, you know, it, so he's not there yet. It, yeah. He's it, sharpening. It, it, it seemed a little bit like a comfort type of thing because uh, 